Now to a story developing out of Alvin. Police there say a man posing as a law enforcement officer kidnapped a girl and sexually assaulted her. Now investigators are trying to track that suspect down. KPRC 2's Rochelle Turner is joining us now live with the very latest. Andy, Lisa, good morning. Parents could not believe the news and they are hoping authorities can catch the man responsible. It's terrifying. This morning, parents are still in shock after learning that an Alvin High School student was abducted and sexually assaulted. I had no idea. It terrifies me. I just dropped my 16-year-old daughter off. The Brazoria County Sheriff's Office says the incident happened on October 19th. Officials say this man posed as a truancy officer and convinced the student to get inside his car on Cleveland Street near Alvin High School. Authorities say the man drove her to the Chocolate Bayou boat ramp at State Highway 35, where he sexually assaulted her before dropping her back off. But always teach your kids not to get in a car that you don't, somebody you don't even know. Alvin ISD says they are aware of the incident and released a statement that says, in response, Alvin ISD has increased police presence in the area and will continue to assist the Brazoria County Sheriff's Office as needed. Authorities are still searching for the man described as a white or Hispanic male in his early to mid thirties. He's about five, seven with a medium build, short brown or black hair and brown or black eyes. He was driving a late model Chevy Malibu. Yeah, it's, it's scary. Hopefully they they catch him here soon. And if you know anything about this incident, you're asked to call the Brazoria County Sheriff's Office. Reporting in Alvin, I'm Rochelle Turner, KPRC 2 News. All right, Rochelle, thank you.